So this video is still on the chapter of vectors and vector addition, etc. And we are working on vectors on vector spaces. We have been introducing this uh, symbol of summation. And the, in this video I want to introduce some further notation and operations under the symbol of summation. Okay, let us pick this example. We have n1 smaller than n2. And we are asked to define this the summation from k equals n1 to n2 of f of k. So this is easy, right? Because this will be f. So it starts in n1. But please be careful here because it will finish in n2, so this will be n1 index 1 plus 1, right, because we are summing, plus f of n1 plus 2, right, and it will go on and on, and it will finish in f of n2. Okay, and um, okay, I I I was hesitating because uh, I did not mention a, a a fact. Sometimes you might be asked to, uh, for instance, let us say this is n and you are asked from n2 till 1 okay this is defined there are no special rule but this is defined to be 0 right if your index here is smaller than your index here this is defined as be, being 0 this is only a definition okay you might get some book with some odd ideas about this, but this is the, the, the definition uh, most used. Okay, so this is a special case. Okay, I hope you got this this example. This is nothing to do with this. This was something that I, I just suddenly thought. So from k equals n1 to n2, f of k, so f of n1, f of n1 plus 1, f of n1 plus 2, f of n1 plus 3, etc. till f of n2, and that will be the last element of the summation. Okay, let us do some quick summation of some... I, I just threw numbers here. I'm not very good at throwing numbers, but... Okay, so this will be... 1 squared, right, plus 2 squared, plus 3 squared, plus 4 squared. Okay, and now you do the, the, the addition here. Okay, uh, if we had s something like k1, 2, 3, for instance, and if you had something like k squared plus 1, then you had to do 1 squared, 1 squared plus 1, right? That would be the first summoned. Then 2, so that would be 2 squared plus 1. Okay, and then there will be 3, 3 squared plus 1. Okay, and now you do the math, this is a simple addition.